as we look at this question it is asking us for side to side movement so here you notice we are moving the head to right and left side no movement no it is the c1 c2 joint which is called as atlanto axial joint atlas bone is c1 bone and axis is the c2 bone the dense of axis is going to fit into the atlas bone so here we got the atlas bone here and below that is the axis this is the axis bone here and which is sending one process called as the odontoid process or dense of the axis and uh, it is a rotatory joint pivot synovial joint and the skull is rotating on the c2 bone let me draw a diagram for the same then it will become more clear so we are talking about the c2 vertebra which is called as the axis vertebra it becomes the axis actually it is having a projection called as the dense of axis or the odontoid process of the axis which fits into atlas bone which is the c1 vertebra so here we have the c1 vertebra which is also called as the atlas vertebra and the joint between the two is called atlanto axial joint this is the midline atlanto axial joint which is a pivot synovial joint and this pivot or pivot synovial joint is the one which is a rotatory joint so it is the atlas which will be rotating on the axis created by the dense of the axis now when the atlas is uh, rotating along with that the skull is also rotating so skull and the atlas become one unit and this one unit is rotating on the c2 vertebra so skull will be here this is the skull and skull is uh, along with the atlas vertebra becoming one unit and that one unit rotates on the other unit which is the axis this is called as atlanto occipital joint what is the importance of uh, atlanto occipital joint then atlanto occipital joint is for yes movement where the occipital bone can move on the atlas bone let me show you the diagram now but remember atlanto occipital joint is ellipsoid synovial joint and that ellipsoid synovial joint is for yes movement or nodding movement so as you notice here there is a flexion and uh, extension going on which is uh, a nodding movement yes movement and uh, skull basically the occipital bone is uh, moving on the atlas bone atlas bone which is present inferiorly the c1 vertebra atlanto occipital joint this is the condyles of the atlas and this is the condyle of the occipital bone atlanto occipital joint is elliptical shape ellipsoid synovial joint and this ellipsoid synovial joint is for yes movement or the nodding movement so at present because the question was asking side to side movement which is the no movement we'll keep our answer as the atlanto axial joint we also know that the joint is pivot synovial joint which is a rotatory joint also called as trochoid synovial joint trochoid synovial joint pivot the other name then what about the atlanto occipital atlanto occipital is skull vertebra joint for the yes movement nodding movement and that is ellipsoid synovial joint but we'll keep our answer as choice number b here